Hi everyone, this is another League of Legends update and it is a charm spotlight. I haven't been making a lot of polymer clay things since I got back. Um, but this one is actually something that I made for a friend of mine and he is in love with the champion Thresh and I will put a photo here. Basically I made the scythe for Thresh as well as the lantern and the little lock. And this was inspired by some pictures that I saw on Google. So the design is not mine and um, I basically looked at a couple pictures. I looked at the Thresh art on League of Legends and I saw some other people's interpretations of the Thresh lantern and scythe and I decided to put my own twist on it. So it definitely is a lot of inspiration based on the art from League of Legends. But then, of course, there are some details that may be inspired by others, especially the fact that these are flat. I thought making them flat pieces was a little more durable and a little easier. So I saw a lot of crafters do that, and I decided that actually was the best thing to do. So let me show you what I did for the scythe. So here is the scythe, and um, if you look at the art, it's not very clear what this looks like. A lot of different artists have different interpretations. So this was my interpretation of what the scythe looked like. So I definitely did texture it a little bit right here. And um, I carved everything out very slowly, pieced them together very slowly with the dotting tool and a blade. And I backed it on some black clay just so it was easier to kind of position everything. So I love backing things now. I think it's my new favorite thing to do. Definitely backing it with black clay made it a little more durable. So I was able to make this little point here. And I used my blade to make some indents. And this is translucent green if you're wondering. And I mixed black with some silver clay from Primo to get this color. So this is what the lantern looks like. And here is a little lock. The lock isn't all that special, but it's part of the lantern, I suppose. And I really did want to make this 3D, but my trans oops but my translucent green clay was just too soft and I wasn't able to really cut the shape correctly so this is what I ended up with and as you can see with both the scythe and the lantern I did texture the green translucent part because I wanted to make it kind of look like cloudy or soul like since Thresh actually traps souls inside his lantern so they're kind of trying to come out for lack of better words um, so yeah that's pretty much what it looks like it's a uh, pretty cute in my opinion. I hope my friend likes it. If you have any questions, let me know down below. But I will put some links of some of the Thresh trinkets you can buy on Etsy. And they are made out of acrylic or acrylic plastic, I suppose. Um, this is obviously made out of polymer clay. If you want to ask for a custom Thresh lantern and scythe, I would be more than happy to make it for you. It may not be exactly the same since I did hand carve all of this, but I will definitely try my best. So uh, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will put links down below for where you can buy your own scythe and lantern on Etsy from other sellers. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.